We've all seen the post on Reddit, some Rocket League player claiming to have found a new mechanic that they unsurprisingly also name after themselves. While this can be a little cringy and often results in a very swift and negative response from the community, I also think it highlights the beauty of this amazing game and the thrill of discovering new skills and moves. So I decided to encourage that creativity by asking players of all ranks to send me the best mechanic they've ever invented. My goal was to choose at least one from each rank based on three criteria. The written pitch for the mechanic telling me why it's special or useful, the name they gave it, and the footage they supplied to prove its legitimacy. Now I went into this thinking it would mostly be a meme mechanic showcase, with submissions like Musty's Obama flick, which are not really a mechanic, just a funny move that you can use to score. Now while I did choose some of these entries based on the meme or entertainment factor, I think we actually found a few that are new mechanics. I'm really excited to show these to you, so I hope you stick around to the end to see them all. Let's get started. Now despite getting over 150 submissions, I really didn't get many from the lower ranks. So as we start at silver, we're going to lean heavy into the meme side of things with a mechanic that was invented by my then 8 year old son. This happened in a previous video while he was playing against a fellow silver who had called him out as a bad player. Okay, oh, that was something. What do you call that move? I don't think that one has a name. Called the seal flip. The seal flip. Oh, I see it. Okay. Seal yeah. flip. It's a new mechanic, I think. Now, my son has an obsession with seals and goes by the name Seal King. So him coming up with the name Seal Flip is not really a surprise. Now, whether he can do it again is doubtful, but I think we'll let it slide for our first entry. And the comment section was actually still pretty excited about it. So maybe the Seal Flip has a future in Rocket League. When I read our next entry's pitch, it was like he knew exactly what I was trying to do with this video. So pay attention closely as Wooden tells us how to do his mechanic, the rocket launch. Rockets just got discovered in Rocket League, and you can take off with this instant classic mechanic. First, equip the backfire vehicle to allow fire to come out of the back of your car. Also, equip the burnout boost to create rocket noises. Equip the flames decal for added propulsion, and you're ready to go. Now, get into the reverse Obama position and hit that ball for the best goal you've ever scored. Now, I want you guys to remember the name Wooden because we'll be coming back to him in a minute. He's a diamond now, and he has some more interesting mechanics to show off. Now, if we're going to believe the typical plat stereotype, you'd think my submissions would be mostly cocky platinums naming flicks after themselves. In reality, though, I only got 15 plat entries. And while most are disappointing, I did like this Heatseeker play from Astrion Knox. Now, I've seen people hit the ball backwards and then go for the redirect before, but the way Astrion does it is pretty unique as he gets himself moving down the field while he hits the ball backward at the same time. It's still a pretty great play for a plat, but I'm not going to go so far as to suggest that Astrion has totally disproved the plat stereotype with this one. I mean, he still named it after himself, calling it the Knox Heat Kickoff. And then in the picture mechanic to me part of the entry form, he only wrote, I understand. Which actually tells me that, no, he did not understand. I received a lot of diamond submissions, but unfortunately, none can compare to Wooden. Not only does he get the whole meme mechanic pitch part of this video as displayed with his gold rocket launch submission, he actually comes up with some real mechanics. And because of that, I'm going to feature three more of his entries for the diamond section. For the first diamond mechanic, Wooden writes, This mechanic is essentially a cuxer pinch sautéed for a while and garnished in hot sauce. Why is this useful? Because being backwards adds more sauce and gravy to your pinch, which makes the opponent usually insta-forfeit or go AFK in awe. Now what I love about this is it's not just a lucky play he can never do again. No, Wooden provides a montage of clips showing him pulling off these incredible backward pinches in game. And the guy doesn't even try and name it after himself. He says it's the backwards pinch. And the name is perfect because it doesn't confuse the listener and will inform them exactly what this mechanic entails without ever seeing it. Wooden's description for his next mechanic is short and to the point. He says, The most brutal mechanic, the most feared shot to get scored on, and the most humiliating way to let your car soccer career get destroyed. The bulldoze. There's no explaining this mechanic, just bulldoze. Yes, you're not missing something here. Wooden has decided to name the mechanic of just pushing the ball into the net. You might think he's about to do something else, but no, just bulldoze. The final mechanic from Wooden is another one I would actually say is legit. This is the mechanic he says that has potential to come in handy to get extra speed like a curve dash. And it's useful if you're in the inside of your post, whether it be by accident or on purpose, and the ball is coming at you from the corner closest to you. To do this mechanic, he says you have to have three quarters of your car off of the post, then front flip wave dash onto your backboard and jump and flip into the ball. The name Wooden suggests is either the bar dash, which he says is nice and simple, or alternately, the omelet mush party dash. So I guess we'll have to let the community decide on that one. At 28%, champion players had by far the most entries. But honestly, 
They were pretty boring. Thus, I've decided to go with this meme submission from a player named Retzalem. He says, The Red Flick is the most slept on mechanic in Rocket League. Unveiled nine months ago on Sledge's very channel, this flick can catch even veteran players off guard. At first, it looks like a front flick gone wrong, lulling the enemy into a false sense of security. Once they think it's safe to move in, bam, you hook the ball with the backside of the flip and send it over the defender. Now, before you guys get all excited, I know we've probably all done a failed flick before. In fact, a GC submitted something similar that he was calling the Oxy by Proxy. The reason why I chose this is because it's a callback to when Retzalem submitted a similar goal for my calculated video series. In that video, I jokingly said if he was a plat posting to Reddit, he would have called it a new mechanic known as the Red Flick. Now, a lot of people in the comment section did not get the joke. I gave it the name, guys, not him. Now, no one actually goes for these on purpose, but you know what? Just like the Athena flick, I feel like it at least needs a name. Therefore, I propose we as a community consider dubbing it the Ret Flick. I have two mechanics for the GC section, and both have interesting stories to go with them. The first is from a player named Tomo. He says, We've all done this mechanic, we just didn't realize its full potential. You might recognize it as instantly flipping while celebrating your win, or joining training and immediately flipping by accident. This happens because when you spawn in, you were actually a bit above the ground. Before landing on the ground, you can do a useless flip or a wave dash. When well-timed, this bug dash can be used to cheese any training pack containing shots or saves that are almost unreachable. Yes, Tomo has actually had several streamers like Scrub and Corrupted G give up on his training pack because there was no way to get some of the shots without knowing the bug dash. He's also set some speedrun records on the dribble challenge maps due to his ability to wave dash off the start. But here's where it gets interesting. When Tomo was explaining his mechanic to me, I came up with an idea of a way it could be applied in-game. You see, when you respawn from a demo, you were also slightly in the air. We went into a private match to test it out, and sure enough, with the right timing, it worked. I think we actually have stumbled upon the fastest way to get back into a play after a demo. Now, despite my contribution, Tomo was hesitant to rename it the Sledge Dash, which might have something to do with the fact that there's probably no way I ever pull one off. But if I was going to suggest an alternate name to the Bug Dash, I think Spawn Dash would be a good contender. The next GC mechanic is definitely a meme, but it's a good one. This is how its creator, Furnace, explains it. What started as a theory about baiting TikTok comments to abuse the algorithm has turned into a movement of over 4.7 million views and players actually trying to use the mechanic in game. A simple musty flick motion on your kickoff is all it takes to execute a perfect Furnace kickoff. My use of the Mantis definitely makes this a legitimate viable kickoff strategy, as most players do not expect such a dumb kickoff and the plank hitbox is large enough to stop even the fastest of speed kickoffs. And this includes SSL players. Yes, this mechanic was originally designed to create engagement on TikTok, and boy did it ever. The thing is, while people type their hate comments about his mechanic, they are also increasing his watch time, which has helped his account blow up. It's brilliant. Also, the kickoff does actually seem to work pretty well. Sure, he wasn't the first to do it, but a lot of times, mechanics aren't attributed to players because they invented it. No, it's usually because they popularized it. So when Furnace writes that he called it the Furnace Kickoff because he's fake claiming that he created his own mechanic, I disagree. This is the Furnace Kickoff now. There's no shame in having your name on it. You earned it. Unfortunately, once I removed all the troll posts, I was only left with one submission from a supersonic legend. Why? Probably because SSLs are too busy being gods at the game. Yoshi's mechanic is described as follows. This move is only able to be used in Spike Rush. You can easily gain height by front flipping into the ground with the ball on top of your car. Once over your opponent, all you need to do is release the spikes and enjoy your free goal. Now it seems like Yoshi is bouncing the ball off the ground to launch himself into the air, which actually could be useful as carrying the ball in Spike Rush doesn't allow you to use boost. For a name, he just says, the Yoshi flick, because I'm lazy. No doubt too busy being the best rank in the game to bother coming up with a unique name. In fact, I think he's actually just daring us to challenge him for naming it after himself. It's all right, Yoshi. As the only SSL I had to pick from, I think we're just going to let you have this one. That brings to an end the Meme Mechanic Showcase. Thanks to everyone who entered, and my apologies to those I overlooked, but I think this really turned out to be a much better video than I was expecting. If you enjoyed it, make sure you hit that sub button, and comment below what your favorite mechanic is. My name is Rocket Sledge, thanks for watching.